Most people don't think about football when they hear about India. What first comes to mind probably is delicious food, colorful Bollywood movies or cricket. But what many people don't know is that India has a very long history of football. Some of the oldest and biggest teams in Asia are actually from India. East Bengal Football Club is one of them. আমাদের জোড়াবাগান ক্লাবে আমাদের আমাদের শৈলেশ বোস খেলতেন শৈলেশ বোসকে চক্রান্ত করে দল থেকে বাদ দেওয়া হয়েছিল অন্তত এইটা এই ইতিহাসটাই আমরা জানি তো সেই রাগের বহিঃপ্রকাশ থেকে বাঙালের যে রাগের বহিঃপ্রকাশ যে আমাদের বিরুদ্ধে যে বঞ্চনার যে ইতিহাস সেটা জায়গা থেকে আমাদের ইস্ট বেঙ্গল ক্লাব তৈরি এবং আমাদের যখন আমরা যখন প্রজন্মের পর প্রজন্ম ধরে যখন কলকাতায় এসছি এই পশ্চিমবঙ্গে এসছি ওই ওই পারের রাজনৈতিক অস্থিরতার কারণে ওই ওপারবঙ্গের রাজনৈতিক অস্থিরতার কারণে তখন প্রজন্মের পর প্রজন্ম ধরে আমরা এখানে আমাদের ঘর বাড়ি সব কিছুই আমাদের একদম একদম শূন্য থেকে শুরু করতে হয়েছে যখন আমাদের ঘর ছিল না তখন আমাদের ক্লাব ছিল যখন আমাদের থাকার জায়গা ছিল না তখন আমাদের ওই গ্যালারিটা ছিল ওই 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 রঙগুলো ছিল তো ওইটা ওইটা অনেকটা আমাদের বুকের ভেতর চলে গেছে যে জায়গা থেকে লড়াইটা তৈরি হয় আর যেই জায়গা থেকে আজকে ইস্ট বেঙ্গল মানেই লড়াই শুধুমাত্র লড়াই In February 2017, we accepted an invitation by the East Bengal Ultras. They invited us to join them in one of the matches of their beloved club. We didn't think twice and immediately planned the trip to witness one of the greatest derbies in the world, the Kolkata Derby. This derby normally is held at the Salt Lake Stadium with a record attendance of over 130,000 people in 1997. Unfortunately, during this trip, the stadium was under renovation for the upcoming FIFA Under-17 World Cup. For this reason, the venue was then moved to a much smaller stadium in Siliguri, a town that is roughly 10 hours train ride up north from Kolkata. This gave us enough time to get to know some of the members of the East Bengal Ultras, who gave us some insights of their fan culture. Like many others, East Bengal Ultras also had their fair share of difficulties and struggle at the beginning. Even though the overall attendance of the club was generally good. The initial days have been like quite difficult for us, uh, but sl uh, slowly and steadily, like we got, we kept on uh, getting the masses volume, and like now we are quite good. The strength is quite good. We went and asked people like, let's do chant, let's do this, but they were not interested. They went. Uh, they were not willing to do so like since we founded in december 2013 after that that uh, whole season of 2014 it was like quite blank our results were also not good and uh, like the team results and also like it was very difficult in getting the other, other guys because people were not interested in seeing us people were not interested they were skeptical about the idea they were not sure whether this will work in kolkata Earlier I used to think that this uh, concept is just uh, a bullshit, rather a waste of time. People singing out while watching a match. Uh, as you know, in Kolkata, this uh, thing is quite uncommon. Because people out here go to watch a match and uh, they just do it for the sake of watching a match and giving slangs to their team and stuff. But uh, they do not have uh, this uh, approach uh, of, uh, you know, uh, being vocal for the team. And the first time my fellow ultras told me about, you know, this concept, I was like, uh, what is this? How can this be possible in Kolkata? Where People are not susceptible to changes uh, so easily. So we were trying to uh, gather some like-minded people so that we can form the group. And then finally, as I said, me and one of my friends, he's also the co-founders of uh, East Bengal Ultras. When we traveled there, we, you know, you know, we took part in chants. We involved the crowd who also traveled with us. And uh, that was the first start. 
there were a few guys who distributed uh, you know some chits of papers which had some you know uh, lyrics uh, written on it uh, and they they told us to chant okay two or three guys and i thought that what is this well, how can this happen in the entire you know one lakh stadium uh, you can't go on people will you know rebuke you and um, make you sit down but then um, slowly got him i slowly got impressed after seeing that smoke show and said uh, this is a new thing this happens in you know the western countries or the latin american countries uh, that i had seen in tv and then uh, i slowly got into touch with two or three of them who were there already and they also realized that i was uh, impressed and uh, uh, then what happened is uh, i f- i felt uh, you know the closeness with with the chants with the lyrics of the chants and i i thought that uh, maybe uh, since i have a loud voice i can help them season we had only some 10 to 15 people in the group so we had to arrange everything we will do the designs we will do the promotion in social media and then we'll also uh, create chants and we'll try to involve the crowd so everything was on us that we took the entire responsibility but as the count grew and we had some 50 to 100 people then we started finding uh, people with interest so if this guy is good in design so he was designing the flags banners and the posters and this guy is uh, like um, in calcutta like uh, people they are also passionate about music especially rock bands bengali and other rock bands so we found us uh, some guys who were actually drummers so they used to join us and they will beat the drums and then some guy would lead the chants then we made them the capo in the stands they will lead the crowd and also during the cortejo and some guys they took the responsibility of the administration part like uh, arranging for the match day tickets and uh, like expenses the finance part they used to do so uh, right now we have uh, very much organized structure so people with specific responsibilities they are assigned to only those tasks we don't if we we don't have any hierarchy we don't have any nobody is a nobody is a like minister or like nobody is a, like nobody is a, the chief person nothing there is there's nothing like that everybody is equal here we value everybody is bengal ultras ajke toiri hoyeche tar tar onek age theke 70 80 doshoke amra jokhon amra amader baba kakader mukhe shunechi ha tokhono kintu ei ei unmadona ei unmottota tokhono chilo এবং মোহম্মান কেন ভারতের কোনো ক্লাবের কোনো সমর্থককেই ছেড়ে কথা বলা হতো না কারণ সিংহের ডেরা যে একবার ঢুকবে তাকে ক্ষতবিক্ষত হয়েই ফিরতে হবে তো সেই লড়াইটা আমাদের আগেও ছিল এখন আমরা ইস্টবেঙ্গল আল্ট্রাস ফর্ম করেছি সেই সেই ইস্টবেঙ্গল আল্ট্রাস তৈরি হয়েছে সেই সেই যে সেই সেই ঐতিহ্যের ওপর সেই লড়াইয়ের যে ঐতিহ্য যেটা আমাদের রক্তে রয়েছে যেটা আমাদের শিরায় শিরায় রয়েছে সেইখান সেইখান দিকেই আজকে ইস্টবেঙ্গল আল্ট্রাস তৈরি ইস্টবেঙ্গল আল্ট্রাস একটা নতুন নাম কিন্তু আসলে একটা একটা যে লড়াইয়ে পরম্পরা সেটার ওপর তৈরি হয়েছে এই এই ইস্ট বেঙ্গল আল্ট্রাস তার বাইরে কিছু না আমি মনে করি এটা আমাদের মধ্যে এটা আমাদের জিনে রয়েছে এটা আমাদের হৃদয়ে রয়েছে আমাদের রক্তে রয়েছে যেটা আমরা নতুন করে নতুন করে তৈরি করেছি ইস্ট বেঙ্গল আল্ট্রাসের মধ্যে দিয়ে উই হ্যাভ লট মেনি ফ্যান ক্লাবস রিয়েল পাওয়ার দেন রেড এন্ড গোল্ড দেয়ার লট মেনি সো ইনিশিয়ালি দে ভার ইন এক্সিস্টেন্স লাইক ফ্রম লাস্ট ফাইভ সেভেন ইয়ার্স ইভেন মোর real power is there for last 10 years so they were i would say they were the first organized group now we have some 20 to 30 active fan clubs and the difference with ultras is uh, the fan club they are also uh, they help the club uh, in different events for example if there is uh, any you know philanthropic event and the club is organizing some sports meet the blood donation camps this kind of event, social activities so the fan clubs will come they will assist the club they also help club in match days they actually act as volunteers during match days uh, but for us the main focus is uh, our opponents so uh, as an ultras our only idea is 
uh, to create uh, the ambience, I mean, uh, so that the opponents will fear to play in our own ground. So 11 players of East Bengal will play, the 12th player will be the East Bengal Ultras. So to create the match, uh, they ambience in such, an, uh, in such a way that the opponents will fear to come and play in our home ground. So that is the basic difference. And uh, we also try to follow uh, the European Ultras and also uh, the North African Ultras. So we use the pyrotechnics on the field. This is also different than uh, usual fan clubs. And we are trying to, you know, do organized chanting, do choreos and uh, like displaying TFOs. So that's how it's different. We, we follow European football. First, uh, uh, what, uh, basically, uh, first of all, there are some clubs we like very much. One is Galatasaray is there because our colors are similar, red and gold. Galatasaray is also red and gold. So we like we like Galatasaray. And then there's Dortmund also because Dortmund we like, uh, we like because it's, it's not only about us. Everybody likes Dortmund because their supporters are known, known to be uh, like uh, hardcore fans. So now, now the chants and all, like uh, previously we used to focus much on European chants. But then we found that if we do that, people will be saying, oh, it's similar, it's similar. So like we started shifting from the European chants and then we started focusing on our local chants. Like, like we started uh, getting inspired from our local songs. And then on the basis of that, we started making chants. So that, like the catchy ones we take. And uh, like, uh, some day, uh, like some of the chants also, like uh, we, we got inspired from the... Uh, uh, this one, uh, Morocco, Moroccan ultras. Like uh, we've started following Raja Kas Casablanca and the, the wider Casablanca. We love them. We lo love those teams also. So uh, we started following them also. So one or two of our chants got inspired from them also. So it's a mix. Like it's, we got inspired some chants, and we got we made also ours. It's not about like what uh, we. Are, it's not a copy or anything. Like it's after all, it's a like fan movement. What we want is the voice. Voice matters ultimately. If the song is taken from somebody else or not, it's that doesn't matter. In this year's local league, Kolkata League, what happened is an, a 75-year-old man, he suddenly out, got out of nowhere and he started chanting with us. Over here in Kolkata, they say people are not susceptible to change. And a 75-year-old man who has been going to the field for ages, he suddenly you know, motivates us. That's the biggest thing I can say. Uh, but the older generation accepting this new new concept that's one of the more positives and people are slowly you know imbibing this culture Previously, we used to go to the games alone and used to sit and alone sit and alone just to and sit and then uh, watch the game. But yeah. with ultras, it's very different. We uh, we participate in the game. I, I mean, yeah. we chant uh, throughout the 90 minutes. We shout at the top of our voice, and the experience is totally different. And uh, thanks for ultras providing this atmosphere. Yeah. Yeah. We feel great to be a part of it, part of the movement. Previously, women used to go separately. So what happened after the ultras came, they became together. They, st they also become a voice and a part of the ultras. So they are the, like the ultras girls. So they lead, and be after seeing the girls, the other, the, like the suburbs, who, people who are staying in that location, they also get interested. Okay, the girls are coming, then we should also go and support the team. So this is how we attract the youth.
So girls has has been a part of our vocals. So girls has done a great business. I want this culture uh, to spread in India for the betterment of Indian football. Not only East Bengal Ultras will do their best. I believe that, and it will it will improve day by day. It will improve their activities day by day. That's that's my promise at least I can say. But I want more clubs to come up with these thoughts so that the competition increases and Indian football can speak of fans who love football. <laughs> निरानो बुरी शाल नगाद तो खून अमी अमी ओने कागे माटे चले गया था मैं अमी तो खून स्टूडेंट चिलम बच छात्रों चिलम तो खून तो माटे के ची बेस ओने एक टा आगे पास्टा छोटा शो में मैस तीन चेस शो में मैं दो तीन घंटा आगे गया ची तो खून अमी देख ची एक टा लोग एक टा पाठा नहीं है इससे माने एक � तो बोले चिलो आम के बोले चिलो लोग टा जे अभी मैच से सोले इटा के केटे खावो तो हमार हमार देखा सब थी के अद्भुत घटना माटे इटाई किंतु अभी शे पागला बीटा मिस पोस्टर होते बने अभी बुझते बने चिलो लोग टा की बोल चिलो लोग टा लोग टा ओवी व्यक्ति टा खूब अद्भुत